I am victorious. Yes, I am victorious. Glory be to God who has given me victory, victory. You are victorious. Yes, you are victorious. Glory be to God who has given you victory, oh victory. We are victorious. Yes, we are victorious. Glory be to God who has given us victory. God has given us victory. God has given you victory. And in every sphere of our lives, we will experience great victory in the name of Jesus. I want to thank you for coming back to watch this video. I appreciate everyone who watched the previous one, who liked it, who commented who shared i would really appreciate it if you do that with this video too now i have an illustration i like um fast cars you know cars that once you press them they answer you they are moving on the road and then someone comes to me and says um can you race for like ten thousand dollars if you win i'll give you ten thousand dollars of course you know what ten thousand dollars means now so quickly i go and prepare and then I look for maybe a car like a Dodge Charger, like the one in Fast and Furious. And I go to the race center. And when I get there, I ask, where's the person I'm competing with? And they just point and show me. A keke na pep. <laughs> exactly. I know that that is how you are going to be. Very ridiculous. Because definitely that keke na pep cannot win me. Now, that is how it is when we trust God. When you trust God, your battles are already won before they even started. God fights for you he gives you victory you do not need to fight all you have to do is trust him sit down and watch and then he comes he gives you the victory on a platter of gold now john 6 33 the message translation says this i have told you so that in trusting me you will be unshakable and assured deeply in peace it does not say you can't be unshakable when it says you will be unshakable it is a certainty. It is not a probability. So every time we trust God, we are sure that we will be unshakable in the battles of life. We will be rest assured in the battles of life and we will enjoy deep peace. The second part of that verse says that in this godless world, you will continue to experience difficulties. But take heart, I have conquered the world god has conquered the world now he says that we will continue to experience difficulties so these difficulties will continue to come they might come from the left from the right from loved ones from friends from wherever it is but there must be a certainty in our hearts that no matter how tough those battles are we are already victorious from the start why because god has already conquered i don't know what you are battling with it might be you know a mysterious affliction or a sickness with a name like cancer, diabetes, hepatitis, whatever it is they call it. God has already fought and won. He has given you your healing. Receive it in the name of Jesus. It might be that you have been going through a cycle of disappointment, of hurt, of pain, of betrayal. And you are asking yourself, why do I have to keep going through these things back to back? God has already risen on your behalf. He has fought for you and he has given you complete victory. All you need to do is believe him and receive the victory. It is also possible that someone has what belongs to you. Your possession, your position, your promotion, whatever it is, it is rightfully yours. God has already taken it from the person because he owns the heavens and the earth. And he has given it to you. Receive it. I pray for you that you will enjoy the victory God has given to you. Finally, I want to say that sometimes the picture of the victory we have in our mind is not exactly the picture of victory God has in his mind. And so if we truly trust God, then we must believe that whatever victory he gives to us is the best and the sweetest kind of victory. This week, I pray for you that in every area of your life where you are fighting battles, God we open your eyes to see the victory that he has given to you. He prepares a table before you in the presence of your enemies. And then you can join me to sing the song. Is my victory thanks so to Jehovah. He has never lost a battle from age to age. Oh, I don't cry. Oh, hey. Now God the fight, now me the we know, yeah, 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 
He's my victory then so eh, to Jehovah. He has never lost a battle from A to A, Joe. I don't cry at all. Eh, eh. I got the fight, now me there we know.